And today we're going to check out Sarge's Deli. It's been here since 1964. Look at that big red sign. I wonder if the food's any good. Let's find out. There's a nice smell in here. I can smell the pickles, everything. I see the lock spreads. Beautiful baked goods. The cheesecake looks fabulous. Cure cake looks okay. And look at the regular. There's a quite a big takeout menu here at Sarge's. I look at the salads, the shrimp, the fruit salads. Everything looks so fresh and nicely displayed. Has she got a table there? Okay. Look at all these people. Old school. I see a lot of celebrities on the wall. Very clean. This is a Sarge Delicatessen restaurant menu. Sarge must refer to policemen. The menu is very extensive here. I see it a big breakfast menu, some omelets, some griddled pancakes, and some cereal. Okay, but this is what you're really coming for. The deluxe sandwiches and the deli food. I see some tongue Rubens. And I wonder if there's even brisket. I'm just going to have a, a corned beef sandwich. Something to drink? Um, Diet Coke? You know what, let me have the, um, I'd like a bagel, an everything bagel with vegetable cream cheese. I'm going to try the coleslaw now. Coleslaw's very creamy and tart. I like it. This is the official corned beef sandwich at Sarge's. Looks like fresh rye bread, cute little toothpick, and I'd say about approximately 8 to 10 ounces of corned beef, thinly sliced. Now it's time to put some mustard on it and check it out. Hey, you guys know what comes next? I'm going to do a taste test. Kind of a savory type corned beef, very moist, sliced thin. Yeah, I give it like an A, very, very decent corned beef. We've done a good business here at Sarge's Full House. I'd say there's about 200 people at the tables here. All the people looking for takeout. Is it a vegetable or a veggie vegetable? Vegetable. Today I'm with the manager here at Sarge's Deli. In an age where a lot of traditional Jewish cultural food have disappeared, there's no more Carnegie Deli, no more Stage Deli, this place looks pretty busy. What's happening? What's happening? You know, we're a neighborhood institution, been here 53 years, family owned. It's a dying breed, it's hard to come by. And, you know, we're, we're a big neighborhood spot, and now with all the other places mm -hmm. moving on, you know, people are finding us. Sure. Now, do you rent here or do you own your own building? Um, we rent. I do not own the building. No. Oh, 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 okay. So, is there a chance with the price of real estate in Manhattan, you might have to move someplace? Or no, I got a pretty good lease. Oh, you got a good, yeah, good, we'll good, be here good, for another. Good, you know, good I think lease. I got another 20, 25 years. On oh, the and uh, just human interest. Are there more tourists or more locals that come to Sarges? Used to be more locals than tourists, but now I would say it's a probably 50-50 split. Okay. Which is great. Okay. Last question's pretty easy. Who has the best corned beef sandwich in Manhattan? I'm gonna have to say that Sarge's has the best corned beef sandwich in Manhattan. Enjoy eating with us at Sarge's Deli. And remember to subscribe to the Tidy Island CPA channel.